Welcome to Texas Coast Sportsman, I'm Aaron, or today I should probably say Texas Coast Garage because it's not about the fishing today, it's about the equipment, kayak trailer behind me. It was a great project, it's finally done, loving it. So as you can see, I've already got the bunks tore off, um, pulled quite a bit of hardware off. Nice and easy when you, uh, when, when you have an impact. When you got an impact gun you can use, it makes rusted bolts a lot easier. give you some perspective of the difference we're talking about here um, take the time you got an old trailer got an angle grinder get you some wire wheels take the time to get that rust and pitting off you can see the difference it makes in the metal get your paint to stick that right there ten dollars Harbor Freight on a good grinder makes a world of difference Now nah, I just got all that to still deal with. As you can see, she turned out pretty nice. Uh, just hand rolled with Rust-Oleum paint. The front mount is a custom piece that uh, basically recovered off the original trailer. Um, the middle bunk board run and the rear one are bunk board mounts 
uh, picked up the pair for like 30 bucks back when I thought I was going to put a John boat on it. And the bunk boards are PVC sewer pipe. Lights are submersible, completely wrapped, completely uh, tethered to the inside of the frame. Bearings were replaced, repacked, original caps. Uh, tires were replaced, original tires were from Montgomery Wards. Um, so it's turned out really nice. I uh, can't wait to, you know, keep using it. I've had it out twice and it's completely changed the way that, uh, that I launch and handle the kayak. Thanks for staying with me guys. Like, share, subscribe, help me grow this channel. Fishing videos are coming back soon. My buddy is coming in, bringing his boat. Uh, we will be out on the jetties. Definitely we'll just be out having some fun. As always, I hope to see you on the water. You hear that? I hear fish.